Hello and welcome back to Expo Hub channel. In this series, we are going to see classify related top questions that could be asked. So in the in today's video, I have shown you in the previous video classify document scope and we have understood all of these things in detail, right? So let's see if you could answer all these questions. Just test your knowledge. All right. So let's say the first question. what is the purpose of classified document scope activity in document understanding what is its purpose why you are using it if this question is asked in the interview will you be able to answer so you can say classified document scope is the third step in the document understanding after taxonomy and digitizing the document this is the third step and the purpose of this particular scope or this activity right the first step in the taxonomy we are organizing how we want our documents in the second step we are trying to digitize the document and the output is getting stored in a text variable and in the classify document scope we are trying to link so when the digitized document has come to the classify step here we are trying to link the particular document which has just been digitized has it is it a invoice is it a rece receipt is it a resume is it a passport so depending on our taxonomy we try to link it in the classify document scope okay using keyword based classifiers getting based on the keyword available in the digital output depending on that we are trying to classify and say the scanned document or or the input that was been digitized that is a invoice or receipt we are trying to do that so just explain during the interview that will give you a great amount of support so let's see the second question what is keyword based classifier so keyword based classifier we use so that means the job of the keyword based classifier is to classify the documents based on the keywords so let's say if i type in invoice bill so every receipt every invoice would have some keyword in common so using those common keywords we are trying to classify the digitized document in the second step right we are trying to classify that what is what is it right what is keyword based classify that should be clear all right now the third question what is the output of classified document scope activity what is the output at the end once you do all this linking and all that the output is called classification results classification results will have all the details so we have created a json file you remember in the keyword based classifier we are creating a json file inside that json file it is going to store all the document type id the keywords that we have created so everything going to get created in the json file so the classification results what it does it generally tells you let's say i want to find out a document type id right what is the output so the output of scanned document has come to document uh, digitized step has come to document text variable and from that variable this output is going to store what is that output was that a invoice was that a receipt so all those kind of details can be found through this output clear so this three questions if you are very clear as to how they what they are how they works i think you are in a good position now so we can move on to our next step in the next video so thank you so much for watching continue to watch continue to subscribe to our channel please do share with your friends anyone who is interested to learn rpa do let them know about our channel and ask them to subscribe to our channel so thank you so, so much for all the support and thank you so much for continuously you are trying to learn and i see lot of comments i am not able to reply to most of your comments because of time limitations but again i i love to see how many people are learning from our channel and getting benefited and i try to read don't worry i am trying to read as many as possible and try to answer as many as comments as possible so thank you so much for all the support guys bye bye